Uh, this is actually day 29, but I was having a look back at day 28's video that I did on Saturday night, and it really was great quality. So this is the second take of day 28's prompt, just to make sure that you're getting the full uh, timing, really, uh, as well as the advice to make sure you can hear everything that I'm saying. Okay. So uh, day 28 was uh, yesterday, Sunday. And the prompt was, what can you hear? One of the advantages, another one of the advantages of the six minute writing wellspring method, <clears throat> excuse me, is that it can be very mindful. It can situate you very much in the moment if you use it to observe things that are around about you within that moment. So your prompt for day 28 is simply, what can you hear? As ever, you can spend your six minutes doing whatever your imagination and subconscious take you. You might start off with what you can initially hear, but it will probably take you somewhere else into a memory or um, maybe into a story. Anything goes. There's no right or wrong to it. The most important thing, as I say each day, pretty much, is to keep writing, whether you're writing fast or slow. Remember, it's just for you. It's not for anyone else at this stage. You can always edit it in the future. Don't worry about editing just now. This is just about opening yourself up. Okay, so your six minute writing. This is a wee treat for me because for me, this is day 29. So I'm getting to do two of these at once. Okay, six minutes on what can you hear right now? Beginning.
Okay, everybody, so that is your six minutes up for day 28. And uh, happy writing, everybody. Take care.